Good day ladies and gents, the main topic of today is uh, invisible players and invisible players caps. But first of all, let's go through some smaller news. Well, according to Logical Solutions, BG increased, the range increased the area within which you can complete uh, what's the name of the quest? Capturing, capturing Outposts, that's the quest where you need to kill uh, 15 players on 3 maps, I believe, in some specific locations. So right now that includes the bridge which is good it's easy to do the quest now and the other thing is that flea market commission was reduced to to or buy by 30 percent right now when you list the items you don't have to pay as much commission as you used to which is also a great change i also wish some of the items had a smaller fee anyway for example like labs key cards because right now it's impossible to get them for cash all of the labs key cards which have been sold on the flea now are available only for some ridiculous offers like people are trading um, green key card for like red and blue or like the trading black key card for yellow violet and red and it's literally impossible to do the trade so the only thing you have to do is like to sit there and constantly refresh and snipe the key cards I don't know how people are getting them unless they're found in raid so yeah I'd rather I'd rather see those key cards on the flea for like I don't know 10 20 30 40 million rubles uh, so at least we have a chance to get them but that's just that's just my preference all right getting to the main point of the video Lots of people were complaining about invisible scaffs, invisible player scaffs. Lots of people in the comments on my previous video. I'm gonna open it up in a second. So a lot of people in my comments mentioned that as well. Um, okay, let me search it. My squad mate was invisible for a while. Occasionally go invisible. There are plenty of comments saying that, so I just couldn't leave the topic aside and I had to talk about that. But yeah, long story short, this is how it looks like from a first person perspective. What the flip, dude? dude I'm this is how it looks like. You get no sounds of shooting, no sounds of uh, bullets, no nothing. You just receive damage and fall over. And uh, this means you're getting damage from an invisible player's calf or a PMC. There isn't much you can do but just like run away and pray that they are... Uh, uh, they're not in the direction where you're running to. It's a very annoying thing. It happened to me a couple of times a swipe as well. I thought the guy was cheating, but apparently it's not a cheat. Apparently it's just a bug. However, some people said that you can reproduce it, apparently. If you figure out how to consistently reproduce it, do not post it. And uh, I have a feeling that this is reproducible. I'm not entirely sure. But this is definitely a big bad thing. And I hope BG already digging into it. It's really annoying and there isn't much you can do. So um, yeah, I decided to share this with you. If this happens to you and your teammates, if one of you spawns invisible, please do report this to BSG. You can send the report via launcher and apparently restarting the game fixes it. So if you don't see your teammate, but your teammate sees you, report it, restart the game. Well, you have to restart the game anyway when you report. And apparently then you're gonna see the teammate. So that's the way it works. Hopefully this is getting fixed soon TM. I think it's a pretty, pretty bad glitch. Um, definitely should be top priority in fixing. I'm not sure when it started happening very often because uh, people said it started happening after the one gigabyte patch. However, I've had this thing last wipe, I've had this thing two wipes ago. Um, and yeah, maybe maybe the new patch made it worse, I don't know, but here we are. Oh, and a little quick announcement, if any of you are willing to support me with uh, money monetarily, of course it's only, only if you wish to. I'm making money on uh, YouTube ads and that's what allows me to buy good equipment like this camera and good lens. But in any way, if you're willing to support me, uh, I've added a couple of options for joining this channel for memberships. There are a couple of prices starting from like one US dollar. Uh, so yeah, I would appreciate that support if you want to, but only, only if you're willing to. This is not compulsory by any means, so just letting you know. And yeah, thank you so much for watching this video. Those are all the updates for today. I appreciate your stay and I'll see you in the next one.